So today I thought I would do another pairing and I'm gonna start with the Live Love polish. This is an old polish. I actually bought this one in, uh, I think it was my second video on YouTube. Um, when I made my second video I showed this one, that time I just bought it. This is a holographic one and it's called Casting, Casting Call. It's really, really beautiful. And I'm going to pair it with I Love Nail Polish. This is new, I just bought it two days ago and I bought it here in Denmark. It's uh, called Mayfield and it's a flaky polish. That's what I'm gonna be pairing today. So this polish is very light and very subtle and uh, I actually chose it on purpose for that. But it's so beautiful in the light or just outside it's so beautiful. So I will be adding two coats. So this is one coat, the one I just put on, and like I said, look at how it looks in the sun, it's absolutely gorgeous. This is two coats. I don't want too much on it. On my nails, that's how I like it. I would do some nail art and uh, if you saw my last video I used some glass foil and I have some here also this I got it uh, a free sample I got from the Danish shop where I buy my I love nail polish I got one blue and one pink so I thought I would try it and I'll be using uh, Moira nail stamping plate number 89, cuts 2. And I'll be using Clear Jelly Stamper 001, black stamping polish. And today I'm wearing double bond as my base coast coat. It's a uh, rich filling also, rich filling and sticky unscented. So I'm gonna start by adding some bonder and then I cut out some pieces of the angel paper different colors not only the blue one but other colors as well um, camera and then I wanna stamp
scarves here. I have different kinds. Um, I bought them in my shopping center. And uh, I'm gonna use some brush on glue. Also these kind. I'm, I mean I'm just trying different options. See how it looks. I'm gonna try this plate also because I'm just kind of doing the nails as I go. So I thought okay try this. I did a, a same here and then a round one here. So I thought I would try this one. So the lines are very uh, skinny, but I'm gonna do it anyway. Maybe I'll go over them or maybe not. They look very skinny. So I'm finished with my right hand and it looks like this. So I'm just going to top coat it. I'm using Colores de Carol today. If it's a good top coat, I don't think it has any effect on the rhinestones as long as you use a good top coat. So I'm just gonna make this hand when I'm finished with the video, but I'm gonna make it the same as my left hand, so. Thank you for watching. If you like the nails, please leave me a like. It helps my channel a lot. And I really enjoy nail art. I hope you enjoy my designs. Subscribe, like, and I'll see you next week. Bye.